This is a new moon night. The moon set at 5.30. It's currently almost 9. So we have a true 0% illumination night. And this is what it looks like. There's no ambient light from the cities. We're out extremely rural. There's no moonlight, no starlight. This is pretty much as rough as it gets. Bring that Gen 2 right up to the camera. There's Gen 2. And so this, there's Gen 3. Uh, it darkens up quite a bit when it goes to film, but here's Gen 2. This is an old film location you might recognize from some of the videos. And Gen 3, same location. This is moving into the dense, deep, dark forest canopy. You can absolutely see a significant difference in performance here. And let's push back to the Gen 2 again. There's the Gen 2 again. And you can see, you can absolutely see and navigate. Gen 2 Plus. Remember, this is a zero illumination night. Nothing. This is a new moon, zero percent illumination, heavy cloud cover, active rainfall, no starlight. This is Gen 2. Gen 2 Plus, 1000 FOM. And this is under forest canopy as well. This is a better camera than the last recorder I was using. The other one was just a Sony Handycam. This is actually a Nikon or Nikon or however the heck you say it. Nikon. This is the Gen 3. Same location. See if I can get it lined up a little bit better. There we go. Same location. Thing to keep in mind, remember, it is brighter in real life. The cameras can only do so well in the dark. The tubes are brighter. But you can see the difference in the brightness between these units. The Gen 2 Plus is absolutely useful. But you can see the difference between a 1000 FOM Gen 2 and a 2500 FOM Gen 3.